growing in Italy. To the Lewis and Annabelle vlogging show. We've landed in Garda, we have checked into Garda, and we are chilling in Garda. Uh, what are we up to, Annabelle? Chilling before we go back out. <laughs> feeling that I'd be a kid in a candy shop. Why is that? So this is the view this morning. <laughs> okay, this is a tour from of our room from the door as you come in. Woo! Here's bathroom. This is El Baño. There's the bed. And there's a wardrobe. There's a little mini desk. And then we've got a balcony with the most beautiful view. If I know how to open the door. So we have a sun lounger. Uh, table and chairs of all of our clothes from drying and the most wonderful view it's so beautiful yeah Right, we're en route for our hike. Uh, I forget the actual name of it, but it's called Butesta Tempesta something. It's a, it's a really cool hike and you get some beautiful viewpoints of Lake Garda. <laughs> Look how awesome this, just look at it. You find that in the UK, I'll give you a go. It's nicer okay. than a Panna Chocolat because it's got chocolate on the outside and it's a bit fluffier. Honestly, it is gold. So yeah, we're just taking a break and admiring these views. It's unreal. Lewis, please don't die. Oh my god. Yes. <gasps> it's a lizard. Wow, look at all these stones stacked. So cool. Ooh. There's the lake. Lots of wind surfers over there. We were paddleboarding on it earlier around here. Um, I can't see our hotel, it's tucked around there, but we have made it to this viewpoint here. How beautiful. It's really hazy over there, Lou. Yeah, it's crazy. Um, there's Lewis. I think we're gonna head back though because we have come a far way and we've got to go to the end of this trail and all the way back to the hotel. 
and it is very hot, ain't it? What are you up to? I'm Rehydrating. Hydrating. Hydration is key here. But yeah, it's so beautiful here. shot of the mountain for this bit of a vlog because you deserve it. There you go. So we're uh, about to head on our trip. We're a bit early getting out of dogs. So Lewis has found a kid's rock climbing wall that he has to try out because he is missing rock climbing too much. It's been over a week. It's too long. I'm not sure to this must be so easy for you. We're just waiting for the coach uh, for our Dolomites trip. We're like 15 minutes early, so this is the perfect time. Sun cream and lack of chalk. It's very difficult. Oh my gosh, Lewis. They're too small, aren't they? Well, you have got your big boots on. Topped out. I'm happy now. Right. So we can see the little town Mori. Mori is uh, the main town here of uh, the Lopio Valley. They are quite nice and blue from Italian. The edge is with Amulet. What's the other bit? What number of coffee is this, Annabelle? I can't remember. Third of <laughs> Third coffee, though? Actually, it's my second year. It's probably my, like, 500 at this point.
at a place called Orpissi. Orpissi. It's pretty nice. It's like a ski resort. Oh, it's, now. it's literally like you, you've fallen into a dream and you've woken up in the stylized, idyllic, like total stereotype of a Italian ski resort town. Basically that. It's yeah. very beautiful. The architecture is amazing and then you've just got mountains surrounding show the, it. Show the Tide and Gal to awesome wall decoration. Oh yeah, the climbers. Yeah, the, right the, the climbers. Yeah, I thought that was quite cool. Very good. Hey guys, we uh, we made it to Malta Sea. Uh, oh, it looks lovely. It's got off the bus. We're just about to go to the market. About to check out a market. Um, yeah, so it's not a bad bus journey really. The public transport is quite nice here. It's pretty similar. Um, <laughs> yeah, people watch when we got the camera like this. But you know, oh well. Delgada took the bus up because we were down in Malcasy but out on, on the ride back up Annabelle was like you know what's a good idea let's go further up and you know what? brilliant idea because this place is amazing Lewis, he's paddleboarding. <laughs> Hello. So, what happened there, Annabelle? Um, I got really scared. Yeah, why don't you show the boys and girls what happened to me? <laughs> I had to get Lewis come to rescue me. I don't know what it is, but it really scares me. Oh, I should probably put that to the side.
It's raining today. It's raining, it's pouring, the old man is snoring. It's yeah. our last day as well. Last Total day in sad time. I was going to take the ferry to Simone de Garda, but we decided not to. No, not it. Simone. Lim Lim oh, Limo. Limo. What a, what a big mistake. <laughs> Simone Limo. Anyway, um, so we're going to Garda instead. I thought, oh, that'd be cool because it's the namesake of the, of the lake, Lake Garda. So. Let's try it out. Yeah, and I don't know what the ferry's like in this weather. I mean, yeah. it would have been nice going on a ferry, but that, the weather has chosen to be bad today. Not the best. And it's our last day, which is so sad. But anyway, we're making the most of our time here. Bye. And we're waiting for the bus. Yeah, bus, bus time. We'll show you the bus later. Here's the lake from Lake Garda. Lou, I'm just gonna look where we are. Oh, look. where are we? Um, where are we? I think we're somewhere. Oh, there's a roundabout. So we must be somewhere here. Hey guys, guess what happened to us last night? We got a nice text saying our flat's delayed. Oh yeah, best part of traveling, man. No. So we are finally waiting for our shuttle after like some mega delays. We have no clue if we're in the right place because there are such big language barriers between us and the hotel staff who are giving us this information. They just wrote the time on a piece of paper. And now we are waiting at a different bus stop to what we got dropped off at, but apparently this is the one we're meant to be at. Height keeps changing, so we don't know if this is right or not. But we're chilling here, we've just had a pizza, and I've had a cheese and ham toasty, and we've got all of our luggage. I'll tell you what, I don't think having an entire pizza to myself was a great move before getting onto a flight. Well, you scoffed that. Oh, Lewis just ate a whole pizza in like 30 seconds, maybe. Personal best, I think. He was rushing, but we still have like 40 minutes to wait. But yeah, very sad to be leaving at this point. Right, on to the next holiday. Well, we have gained an extra day though. That's true, and it's been nice. So yeah. Stressful, but nice. Bye, Lake Garden.